The successes at laser therapy for me over five years have been numerous and countless. Um, let me talk about our success rate. Um, in wound healing, it's close to 100%. Um, there, there's just no, there's no comparison. Uh, there's no detriment. We can't do any harm. Uh, we can only do, do good, if you will, um, with regards to wounds and wound healing. Uh, some of the tougher cases have been uh, hips, hips and knees, um, and end-stage degenerative arthritis. It's very hard to, for a patient to come to you with total end-stage end disease and expect laser to totally fix the joint and return it to normal. It's, it's, that's not going to happen. We can certainly do pain modulation. We can also prepare, perhaps for later surgery, preparing that tissue to really respond well and heal rapidly if they go to surgery. Um, so I think, you know, if I were to say hips and knees, um, 85 to 95% effective, laser is effective, and 85 to 95%. We still have a resistant anywhere from five, uh, five, one to five percent that just don't respond to laser. I think it has to do with the wavelengths that we cannot adjust um, or adjust effectively um, to, count, to capture all those at the end of the bell curves on both ends. But we can capture 95 percent, and that's pretty good, right?